Hey, 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 good morning, guys. How are we? All right, today is Saturday, the 30th of January. So 30 is three groups of 10. Let's learn, let's learn. Okay, outside morning. Can you notice I've got stubble here? So it's not a beard because it's not really full growth, but it's stubble. So it's just, I can chill and I don't have to shave on a Saturday morning, so it's okay. All right, so this is stubble, but it's gray because Mike's getting a little bit older. What do you do, eh? And uh, Mike's wife doesn't like that, so I, I'll shave it tomorrow. All righty. Let's get learning. Outside, can you notice I've manicured, um, using my petrol uh, hedge trimmer, I've manicured the some of my plants out here. Now remember, it's only for adults to use, mums and dads. Remember, this is a two-stroke, two-stroke, okay, petrol trimmer. So you can see here, two-stroke, which means I use normal petrol that we use in a car and it has to have oil in there as well, mixed in with the petrol. So this is a two stroke. Whilst we're out here, just over here, Mike has a bit of a gym room, okay? Now in my gym room, I have certain weights. Now I just thought I'd show you this one, right? So this is 7.5 kilograms, right? But And 7.5 kilograms, remember, one kilogram is a thousand grams, okay? So, but I wanted to show you the shape. So if I start at the top, one, two, three, four, five, six. So this is a hexagonal, prism that shape is a hexagonal prism think six has the letter x in it at the end hexagonal or a hexagon is a six-sided shape so i'll ask you again in the next few days what is a six-sided shape and your job is to try and see if you can remember hexagon and if you know that already awesome and if it's a prism that means it's a three-dimensional means it's it's got a um it's got length height and width so it's got three parts three dimensions okay cool whilst we're out here let's learn something else so we've got a hexagonal prism and check my hose out over here so with my hose this is a 20 meter hose if i unreeled it remember 20 meter uh, one meter is 100 centimeters and remember one centimeter is about this much which is about the width of your fingernail okay so this is 20 meters. Now I would have to unravel this because can you see here, it's got like little, well, they're called kinks and that's the other word we're gonna to learn today. A kink, spelled K-I-N-K, means the water's not gonna flow through. So if I actually connected this to my hose, my tap, I should say, water won't come out because I've got two kinks. So I'd have to pull it out, get the kinks out of the hose, and then water would come out my hose. And you can see at this end, I've got a trigger hose. So this is a trigger hose. So if I push that, water will come out by actually squeezing my trigger. So it's a trigger hose. All right, there's our learning today. Hopefully you enjoyed it. We'll see you tomorrow. See you guys, bye.